Hey guys, in this video, I'll be giving you a review on core pads on a Death Adder wireless. Now, these core pads cost around $10 shipped. That's pretty expensive for just some layers of PCFE, but they do come in two sets, which is good. So before, the glide wasn't too slow or too fast on my stock mouse feet, which are also PTFE. After I switched, it felt about the same. It felt like it was a little bit faster when I made small movements. It was easier to control when I made micro adjustments in Valorant. The most important thing, however, is that the glide is more consistent. I think this could be attributed to the fact that these feet are more than twice the depth of the stock Razor Mice feet. It also felt way smoother, like I was gliding on a cloud. Now on my Viper Mini, the glide still feels nice, especially for stock Mice feet, but I feel like Razor kind of cheaped out on their PTFE material. The core pads are 100% PTFE, so that's probably why the glide felt more consistent and smooth. A lot of the time, I could feel the texture on my mouse pad with the stock feet. I think it's because it's thinner or because I was pushing too hard. Either way, the core pads fixed it. Another thing is that they give you more surface area on the feet. The Razer stock feet didn't come around the mouse sensor. I think on other models like the Logitech G Pro, it was a huge upgrade because the default feet didn't come close to the surface area of the custom mice feet. Plus, if the default feet wear down, you can't really replace them. Here, you have two sets of replacements, and they would generally last longer than the default mice feet anyways, because of the depth of it. So do I think it's worth it? Yes, it's more consistent, more comfortable, lasts longer, has more surface area, and you get another set if they wear out. For 10 bucks, that's a huge upgrade in my opinion. I got these from Lethal Gaming Gear, but you can also find them on eBay and other sources. Thanks for watching.